Hi, welcome back to Eyeball Aeronautics. I haven't put out a video in a while, so I thought this would be a good subject to put out a short video to show you how to find the center of gravity for the wing cores you cut. This particular wing core is a spare that I made for a project that I just finished up on, and it is tapered and swept. So this technique works really well to find the center of gravity on such a wing core. So what I have here is a straight edge screwed down to my table top, and that allows me to slip a T-square underneath it. The T-square can then slide back and forth, which allows me to draw different size boxes on my table top. Uh, the table top itself is just a hard board with a white veneer on it. That allows me to use a dry erase marker, and I can make different size boxes. I got the material for the table top at a home improvement store. A 4x8 sheet costs about $11. Okay, so at this point I'm going to draw the box. What I'm doing is holding my T-square square against the straight edge, aligning the wing core against the straight edge, and I'll mark a mark at the rearmost point of the trailing edge. From there I'll strike a line. Then I reposition the wing core back against the straight edge and establish a point at the forwardmost point of the leading edge and I'll make a line. Slide the T-square over and strike that line. Now I just need another square. This is just a plain old ordinary carpenter's square. And I'm going to use that to close up the box. Once that line's drawn, the box needs to be divided into three equal sections. So I measure across. In this case, I come up with 12 and 3 quarters inches. So I divide 12 and 3 quarters by 3. I'll come up with 4 and 1 quarter inches. So I measure over from the rear line, four and a quarter. Measure over from the front line, four and a quarter. I can check my math by measuring the center area. That should also be four and a quarter. If that adds up right. All I need to do is divide the box with two lines into three equal sections. Doesn't matter which square I use. That completes the box and allows me to use that to find the center of gravity of my wing core. So now I'm going to use this line to transfer the center of gravity to my wing core. So I'm going to pull up this little square and I'm going to transfer that line from the tabletop to the wing core itself. Just place the wing core back in the box and just align the square to the leading edge and transfer the line right to the right directly on the wing core. And that gives me a, a point 
to um, establish the center of gravity on the wing. So then I just square off from the root, from that mark that I made, over to the root of the wing. And that establishes the center of gravity for the swept wing. And that's your line for your center of gravity right there. Then you can just take your other wing core, repeat the process for the other side. And that's it. You're all done. A little bit of Windex. Clean up your tabletop. And you're ready to move on to the next project. Thanks for watching Eyeball Aeronautics.